And joining us now with more insight on this discovery is Dr. Cornet Becker, Dean of the Divinity School at Regent University. Thank you so much for being here. Why is this discovery so important, particularly how it dates to the text of the time of Jesus? Right. So the oldest version that we had of Leviticus uh, actually went back to the 8th century. And this puts us back to possibly the 1st century, definitely the 2nd century. And what's extraordinary about us is that this indeed affirms the veracity, the truthfulness, the trustworthiness of the biblical record that we have. Wow, that's so exciting. What impact will this discovery have, you think, on future translations, if any? I don't think it will because what we have here is that again, um, this comes from the Masoretic text. And so we know that the text that we are using is indeed trustworthy. It is good. It is appropriate. It is fine. That said, how do you think this should affect the way we approach the Bible and the way we study it? Well, first and foremost, we can know that the text that we have of the Hebrew Bible is trustworthy, it is good, it is right, it is unchanged. Uh, secondly, I think this technology is going to help us uncover some more evidence that we have. I love it. Does this lend further proof to the authenticity of the scriptures? Well, yes, of course. Mm -hmm. I imagine you have a text that for 2,000 years has remained unchanged. In all of the ancient scrolls that we have, in all of the ancient texts, this is absolutely unmatched to have this long record of unchanged text. Mm -hmm. Hearing this and people watching, many wondering, so how does this, you think, affect the average Christian listening? Well, the average Christian, I think, should take extraordinary hope mm -hmm. and, and, and say that indeed, yes, every single word, um, and as Jesus would say, every yacht and tittle of the Hebrew can be trusted. And, and, and that indeed that we can take every word and every statement that has been made as true. Mm. This is something that excites you? Oh, extraordinary. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've been excited for a few days since mm -hmm. we found it. We've been aware of this text for the longest period of time. Um, apart from the Dead Sea Scrolls, this is probably the most significant uh, finding in archaeology mm -hmm. for us um, in, in our own contemporary time. And technology played a big role in us being able right. to Right, yes, it. yes. We never thought that this text would be, able, would be ever uh, able to, to be open and certainly not to be able to read it. Yeah, beautiful. Dr. Corney Becker, thank you so much. Much appreciated always. And of course, if you want to learn much more about this scroll and the technology used to unravel it, you can find it all at our website. And of course, that website is cbnnews.com.